Magic Johnson uh, was just named, just named, well, a few hours ago, was named president of basketball operations for the L.A. Lakers. And um, just some of my thoughts. I think this is going to be terrible. A big name with no experience when it comes to talent evaluation. Do you think he will sit in an office the whole day working on roster improvements? I don't understand why they fired Mitch. Jim had to go. Okay. But don't expect Magic to build a team by himself. Very important who is going to be the GM. Hopefully someone with experience of really building a roster. Just think about the CBA. Do you think Magic knows it by heart? Like the really good GMs? And we'll sit down and read the rules and loopholes that come with it. Listen. I, I might be acting like Magic has zero experience. And the Lakers are just hiring because of his name. I'll ask you this. Does he have front office experience? No. That's why a good GM has to be hired. Magic can be the one with the plan and the vision, <coughs> but I don't believe he has the knowledge how transactions, etc., work. Um, I just kind of—I was reading something that they wanted uh, Rob Palenka as GM, a player's agent with no experience either. Am I overthinking this? Don't get me wrong, I really hope he does a great job and he will get, you know, free agents to meet with LA and, uh, you know, he, he makes some moves. He's freaking Magic Johnson. But, you know, I was listening, I think, uh, to uh, Cowherd there, okay? Please don't dismiss it right away. And uh, he made a good point about front office work and popular people. They are not the type of people who work tirelessly in a little room all day. Big eagles and personalities have to be presented and stroked. And big time players have problems evaluating talent. Just look at the job that Michael Jordan did as GM. Terrible. And to not get fleeced by GMs like Sacramento just did, you have to know uh, what you're doing. If they would get a GM uh, to help Magic fulfill his ideas, which I believe will improve the franchise, like say, uh, you know, Buford from San Antonio or Danny Ainge or Bob Myers, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, I would be relaxed and easy. But rookie GM plus rookie basketball head of operations smells like trouble to me. I hope all is well, and I look forward to speaking to you very, very soon.